You can create a folder for your website where you can store and upload documents and graphics that you may wish to present or publish to visitors to your website. To create a listing folder, open your web publishing folder and click on the level that you wish to create the folder. In our case, we only have one level and that is the root level web publishing. Click on the new web page button and then double click on the listing folder item to create a new one. This creates a new container that is a new level for our website so we must ensure that the appearance of this new container will be the same as our root level. So we click on the container and then on the appearance button and choose the same appearance that we chose for our root level. We want to change the name of the container so we can right click on it in the tree view and choose properties which is get info on a Macintosh and give it a name. We're going to be storing study guides and field trip information in here so we'll call it study guides and trip documents. Now with this new folder selected in the tree we can click on the upload toolbar button and locate and upload documents that we want to have stored in here. We can now take a look at what this folder looks like to our visitors by clicking on the view and browser button. Clicking on any one of the items will either open the item as we see here if I click on the PDF or download it if your browser does not have a supported plugin. Notice that when we clicked on the View and Browser button, we were taken directly to the Study Guides folder. That is because the folder was selected when we clicked on the View and Browser button. If the root web publishing folder was selected, we are taken to the base website view that people see when they visit your website. Clicking on the link on the left will open the listing folder and clicking back on the home link will return you to the base level. The next folder I want to create is a collection of photos for the Paris field trip that the class is taking. So back at the root level of our web publishing folder, I create a new listing folder and I'll call it Paris Photos. Once again, I set the same appearance. Once more, I can upload photos that I have stored on my hard drive. I'd really like there to be a thumbnail image of the photos displayed, so I right-click on the white space below my listing and choose Select Fields. If I scroll down to the left-hand side of the resulting dialog, I will see the thumbnail item that I can add to my displayed set of fields and move it up the list so that it is the first column. Now when I view this on my website, I see the thumbnail image as well. Clicking on one presents the entire image. Once more we can click on the home link to get back to the root level where I now see my two documents and two listing folders in the navigation area.